hardest things to do in growing in life is to look at our own stuff. Sometimes it's in our blind spot and we can miss it all together. That's why we have to, uh, why it's good to have feedback and input. It's important to look at it as we have an impact on others. Jesus said that the fruit of our tree, our, our life, can be sweet, love, joy, peace, kindness, or it can be painful and broken, thorny. There have probably been times when we've ignored our own sins and problems and pointed a finger at someone else. We may have been out of touch with our internal affairs because we're still blaming others for our moral choices. When God asked Adam and Eve about their sin, they pointed the finger at someone else. Have you eaten of the tree I commanded you not to? Yes, Adam admitted. But it was the woman that you gave me who brought me the fruit and I ate it. Then the Lord asked the woman, how could you do such a thing? The serpent tricked me, she replied. It seems to be human nature to blame others as our first line of defense. We also may avoid our own problems by evaluating and criticizing others. Jesus tells us, and why do you worry about the speck in your friend's eye when you have a log in your own? Hypocrite, first get rid of the log from your own eye, then perhaps you will see well enough to deal with the speck in your friend's eye. Also, like we can go too far one way, being defensive and blaming others for our choices. In codependency, we can be so caught up with the needs of others that we aren't taking our own inventory and doing self-care and getting our needs met. As we've taken responsibility for our own life, we'll have the fuel to help others. We'll never reach the finish line this side of life. Growth is a lifelong pursuit.